after spending some time on searching for some internet mysteries, on the only social network that is not yet completely taken over by shitposters, aka, Reddit, I came across this post. It was about a weird-looking YouTube channel that might become a new internet mystery, or it could be a genuine user who's just posting videos. So obviously, I instantly clicked the link. Then I saw this channel. Okay, so, some of you might be thinking, this is just another ARG channel. And for those who don't know what an ARG means, ARG is an acronym for, alternate, reality, game. Basically ARGs and YouTube start with some random video with weird title, or it has something weird in the video itself. For example, a video title can be an encrypted message, which leads to a website and the website leads to another clue and that clue probably leads to another clue. That was ARG in a nutshell. Now back to the channel. From the first look it looks like a typical ARG channel. There are some videos with encrypted titles and weird thumbnails. I decrypted them and I got simple messages like, Omega lol, I don't know what to title this, true suffering is not known, ice cream scoop, and so on. Now. By the time I'm uploading this video, his channel is about 1 year old and has 388 videos. His first video was uploaded 5 months ago, so he's been making about 2 to 3 videos per day. That is kind of mind blowing. But I think it's not much compared to this weird guy, who uploads 20 videos per day. But, whatever. Lane Cruz also got 105,000 views in 5 months. If he had a normal YouTube channel, with this dedication to making videos, he would probably be even bigger. Some of his videos are really disturbing to watch, but I'll try to show you one. Once upon a time, there was a family of four. A dad, a mom, a son, and a daughter. They loved torturing people. Loved it. They broke into their neighbor's house and tied everyone up. The father raped the daughter, the son beat the wife with a baseball bat, the mom forced the son to lick her scrack, and the daughter took out a pair of jumper cables and beat the husband with it. As they grew, their acts became more and more depraved. They started pissing and shitting in people's mouths. They forced some victims to eat a can of worms. They started psychologically torturing some victims, like forcing them to watch. I think we can all agree that it isn't a normal video. This was just a beginning of this story. If you, for some reason want to continue watching it, you can search it up on YouTube, because later it gets even weirder, so I don't want to put all the video here. I think, now it's the time to talk about the other side of this channel. Actually, this is not an ARG channel. After some digging and watching all these videos, I found that he has abusive parents, and some health issues, which is really sad. Sometimes, he talks about suicide, how he is tired of life. I don't exactly know why and what happened to him, but it seems that he has experienced some kind of trauma in the childhood. I have not spoken out about this because when I have, people just said to me it's for your own good. You would have died if they didn't do that. You I want to die. Life is filled with pain and yada yada yada, I made two videos about this argument already. I have had CPS be called to my house twice, but it wasn't for that. Some idiot teacher thought that me offhandedly talking about hot sauce was implying mom was force feeding me it. Dumbass. But grandma, oh boy. She yelled at me and told me to never get CPS called again. I think she did this to continue her verbal abuse about me, which I've explained on Twitter. I don't think I need to explain what this video was about, now you see that this channel for him is not just a free time hobby or something, here he shares all his life. Here he mentioned about his Twitter. So I found it. His Twitter description tells us that he's 15 years old, is bisexual and autistic. So this means that he is still living with parents and gets emotionally or physically abused. I feel bad for him, but, maybe you guys can help him. It's not too late to change his life. Maybe it could be a nice comment on his channel or something else. I don't want him to end up like, Harley Dilly. Harley Dilly was a 14 year old autistic teen. Yes, you heard it right, he, was. He had a YouTube channel where he posted gaming videos and sometimes talked about his life. But one day, he ran away from home because of his parents. He tried to search for a place to sleep, and he tried to get into an unoccupied house through chimney, and died. I'm not saying that the same will happen with Lane Cruz, but everything is possible, and if not us, then who can help him? Thanks for the Reddit user who made the post about this channel, and thank you for watching.